Hello, this is Tyler from King Snake Productions. It's also Super Power of Fun Time. It's my YouTube channel. This is a quick tutorial on some cool tricks with your Mac. Alright, well, first, you're going to want to open Terminal. This is called the Matrix Effect. It's this little app right here. And if it's not saved there, which it probably won't be, just open Finder and search Terminal under Applications. You'll get it up. Yours won't look like mine. I customized mine, so yours are probably just going to be black and um, white instead of green and black. And you're going to want to type this in. While space true in parentheses, do echo hyphen n quote error all data lost end quote, and then done. Now anything in here like all data lost that can be anything you want like this or I'm just going to keep it as error all data lost. Going to want to copy that. Open up terminal, and you're going to want to paste it in there. And whatever you wrote, it's just going to keep replaying that over and over again. It's a cool little trick you can do with Terminal. And I apologize for my cat. <laughs> um, here's another cool trick you could do. This one is basically unclickable desktop icons. Here's what you want to want to do for this. You're going to want to take a screenshot, and if you don't know how to do that, you hold down Command, Shift, and 3. Just like, like Control, Alt, Delete, but Command, Shift, 3. This will take a screenshot. Go ahead and do that now. And if you do, take it of the desktop. Make sure the mouse is off screen. Um, open it up, and you'll see, hey, that's just a picture of your desktop. Now, drag that away. All right? Now copy everything in here. You're going to want to put it in a folder. Oops, forgot to do that. Alright, so make a folder and paste everything on their desktop into that folder. Now I'm just going to title this um, desktop so I don't forget where it is. And save that folder somewhere in their finder. Like let's just put it into um, documents. Alright. Now, you should preferably do this when no applications are running, but since QuickTime Player, which I'm using to record my screen, is running, uh, I can't do that. Now, set that picture you just took, as that screenshot, as your background image, and put it in their trash can. Empty the trash. Now, what's going to look like their pretty much normal desktop background, you're going to have unclickable applications. But down where my mouse is down here, see all that's all messed up and jumbled up? That won't happen to you if you don't have any applications running. So, again, always remember to close out any running applications. So, most likely what's going to happen here, they're going to try to click on one of these applications and, oh hey, it's not working. Mostly because it's just an image and not their real icon. That would most likely get them really mad and it's kind of amusing to watch. So... And after they get mad and you tell them what you did, just simply open up that, pretty much that folder you just opened, and drag everything out of it back onto their desktop. It's going to appear up in the left-hand corner, so just delete the folder, and what you're going to want to do now, arrange by, and then click any one of those listed. That should drag them all back, and after everything is back to normal, open... Just set the wallpaper back to something else, like, say, um, Elmo. But not just any Elmo. Let's make it an Elmo taking over a city. So don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe for more Mac tips and tricks. And this is Super Pyro Fun Time. Out.